Hello everybody, this is Julian. Today, we are playing Home Base on the Scholastic website. This lets you play many games based on popular children's book series. But today, we're going to be playing the game based on the popular children's book series. Wait, where is it? Oh my gosh. Where's, wait, where's the level? Get, no, get off the bench. Go <laughs> Oh, there it is, there it is. You have to go down, we have to go down. We have to go down. Down the stairs. Yes, yes, we're almost there. This it is. Alright. We're gonna be playing, uh, oh, there, a moat. Wait, no. I don't really know my character looks like this. It looks like this in the top left. It's supposed to look like that. I don't... Oh my gosh. Cool. Amber Apollo 96 says greetings. <sighs> Key rules. Clean language. No bullying. No personal information. No links or usernames from other sites. First name and state are okay. Tap the globe icon for global chat. You can chat there with players anywhere in the game. Tap the pin icon for local chat. Those messages are only seen in your current room or event. Um. Okay, so let's let's do this. Enough stalling. Let's play the thirty-nine clues. Um. Let's. I think clue hunt. You have a choice. One million dollars or a clue. As a Cahill, your family has been behind every major event in history. Wait. Here's audio. Yet. Yeah! The hunt is on! I, sh I play Clue Hunt. Yes. This is it, you guys. We're about to play Clue Hunt. Okay. I hope that audio is good. You are Cahill, a member of the most powerful family in history. It's Mr. McInter. I've re I'm not that far into the first book. From what I've read so far, it's pretty good. Hidden around the globe are 39 clues that guard the source of the Hill's legendary power. See how the books are basically about this family that has a ton of really powerful people in it. And then these kids who are part of the family have to go on a scavenger hunt using these clues to try and get a legendary power, the source of the power of the family. And I, I'm going to find it before those kids do. Take that, Dan and Amy. It's up to you to find them and unite the Kill Hill family before they destroy each other. Or the world in the process. Every Kill every belongs to one of four family branches. Discover your branch by unlocking your hidden tiles by taking the following quiz! Confess, would you rather be professional? <laughs> ah, we're gonna figure out what branch you are from by taking this test! Um... Would you rather be a professional athlete or a secret agent? A secret agent. Pick one. Pick quick. Which would you rather explore? Uh, 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 uh. A, um, a, uh, top secret laboratory. Laboratory. Tell the truth. Would you rather record a hit music album or win three Olympic medals? Um, Olympic medals. That sounds more important. Negotiate world peace or discover cures for deadly diseases? Um, this one. Remember, we know, we will know if you're lying. Uh, would you rather be president of a country uh, or a world famous rock star? Um, the president. Final question: Would you rather have star in the sky named after you, a star in the Hollywood Walk of Fame, a uh, Walk of Fame, a uh, star in the sky? Oh, I'm a Lucian. What? Uh, well done. You've been identified as a member of the Lucian branch. You have a lot to live up to. You're related to the most powerful leaders and spies in the world. 
Follow in the footsteps of your famous ancestors, Napoleon and Catherine the Great, to win, but by whatever means necessary. I'm related to Napoleon? That's insane! What's going on? You're ready for the clue hunt. We all have Mr. McIntyre's training exercise to get started on your mission to find the 39 clues. This was advertised in the end of the book. This is how I know that this is here, and this better be good. This must be some internet-wide, you have to fly places to get some massive prize. Alright. Code break. Pick and hold a letter tile from the bottom of the screen and drag it to an encrypted tile. If the letter correctly matches the symbol, the letter tile will click in and all encrypted tiles with the same letter will be placed with the correct letter. If the letter tile does not match the symbol, the encrypted tile will glow red and red slash will appear in an encrypted tile with that symbol. <laughs> Just correctly decipher all encrypted tiles before your chances run out. Soon Dan and Amy Cahill would pay. Ooh. Welcome, Agent. Your mission is to decipher this encrypted mission. Miss message. Her lawyer, her lawyer brought out the alternative version. Would okay, I figured out that first part, which had been. Her most awarded for seven years. No, graded. Gar guarded. Well done. You've decoded the encrypted tile with the correct letter. All the letters need to needed to solve the encrypted messages will be provided however not the letters provided will be used not all the letters provided will be used decode all the encrypted tiles to solve the message all right here we go so what does that mean her lawyer brought brought out the alternate 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 version, which had been her most guarded secret for seven years. I did not figure out the secret. I did it. Her lawyer brought out the alternate version. Well done on solving your first code breaking challenge. Mind dive. <laughs> Tap on a command to insert it into the panel for execution. When you're ready to start your program, press the execute button. Turn max to display and remove carefully and press the execute button as few times as possible. Welcome, Agent. You'll program the submarine by programming and commands. I'll guide you on how to program your first command. Damn it. Scaredy, I feel like I'm gonna run into that bomb. Nice work. This command like then. Proceed by placing an ingesting command in your program and when you're ready. See your commands. I do you entered in commands to fill the program. Excuse for them to move this up. What? Continue entering commands into the program to move this up. Reach the beacon in the fewest number of keys possible that earn the highest score. I did it! What? Well done on reaching, successfully reaching your first beacon! Woo! Mission laser. What's this 3D grip? Use arrow keys up, down, left, and right to move in that direction. Time your movement to make sure that you're not hit by or run into any lasers. If a laser hits you, you'll lose a life except from an earlier checkpoint. Clear through all doors before your lives run out. I gotta do this. I stop! Welcome, Agent. You've gained remote access to this robot. Dodge lasers by controlling its movement. Clear through all the doors before your lives run out. I'll guide you on how to get started. 
Nah. This feels like... Have you ever played that mobile game Crossy Road? It's just that. I was pretty good at that game. Can't go back. Yeah, it's literally just Crossy Road. Which is literally just Frogger. Good job, you've made it this far! Ah! Oh my gosh! Oh, was... oh no! And like Crossy Road, this game actually requires a, a ton of strategy and planning. Woo! Yes! Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes! Alright. Congratulations, you find out which KO branch you belong to, and you've gone through the appropriate chain for the training for the daunting task ahead. How long is this gonna be? I've already been playing for 10 minutes. Ugh. Let's do this. You're ready to complete the missions and find the 39 clues. Good luck. Daily missions. Daily missions collect each of 39 clues. You can check your progress under the th clues collected tab. Wait, so I'm not gonna be able to get all the clues today? I'm kidding. So. I guess I'm coming back tomorrow, and the day after that, and the day after that. What's going? Code break. I'm pretty good at this one. This one should take place in Paris, France, or rather, I should say, under pa Paris. Oh, are we going to the catacombs? You're going to the catacombs of Paris, breaking a code and uncovering a clue. Be brave, Cahill. Good luck. What is this? Franklin? I think that says Franklin. Benjamin Franklin. Right there. There we go. Benjamin. Benjamin Franklin. Lucian agent Ben Lucian agent Benjamin Franklin What is going on? I ran Salute Deep Among Us Lucian agent Benjamin Franklin hid Hid deep in the catacombs. Oh, Lucian agent Benjamin Franklin hid I iron sol salute deep in the catacombs place amongst the. Well done, agent. Your first clue message has been solved, and the clue contained within it has been collected. Interview the keys I've collected so far in the clues collected tab. Iron salute. Location: Paris, France. Branch, Lucian Branch, the Maze of Bones. American founding father Benjamin Franklin did more than just the sign a kite that got struck by lightning. He was a Lucian in charge of hiding a Lucian clue in Paris. Only he hid the clue too well. He was lost for centuries until you found it. Is this spoilers for the book I'm reading right now? Oh no. The crest had eh, had fascinating the crest had Dan, I don't like Dan. I feel like we're supposed to like Dan in the book, but from what I've read so far, he's just really annoying. Amy um, what's her name? Amy is the only. Um, she's cool, but I don't really like Dan. No. This, uh, this 
so the crest had uh, had fascinated Dan, though he didn't know what it meant. I always oh had always fascinated Dan, although he though he didn't know what it meant. Well then, you got three sets for decoding this message. Solve the message with the fewest number of mistakes. One of my stars. Yes. Yes. Nine clues. I I'm reading this book right now. I can't believe it's not going to let me get all of the clues today. I, I'm recording right now just so that I was going to play this entire game. That's so dumb. I'm, get, I'm changing my time to tomorrow. See? It's actually a... Wait, now I have to do this for settings, right? But this isn't worth it. I just can't believe it. Who would go that low? I, this is not what I wanted. This is just a load of baloney. Who made this? Did you really expect me to keep coming back here day after day for 38 more days? This is just, what? I don't freaking care! Oh my gosh! What you guys spoil all the books for me? Well, maybe I shouldn't play this game, huh? Maybe I shouldn't. I can't even do that right. I'm reading the book right now. You don't wait. No, are you taking it back up? Oh my gosh. You know what? Who even cares about the 39 clues? It's a garbage book series anyways. So how about instead we play a game based on a much better book series. Let's see. Babysitter's Club. I've never read those books. Um. The Last Gate of the Emperor. I've never read those books. Wings of Fire. I've never read those books. Force of Fire. I've never read those books. Books. School summer reading. I, oh, it's Clifford. Nemecorn Island. Jelly stickers. What are these books? George. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait. Get up, get up. They have a goosebumps land. This is it. Yeah. Slappy's. Drop dead house. Let's hope you don't get too scared. Ooh. 
This website's bogus. Sloppy. Hey, dummy. <laughs> Looks like you wandered into dead hell. <laughs> Hi. Don't worry. You won't be dead. Unless any loud noises wake up the headless ghost. <gasps> Let's play! Oh. Oh, oh. Looks like you've wandered into Dead House. Stop Slappy from waking up the headless ghost by catching all the objects he throws down. Watch out for a special trick object. I'll give Slappy a scare, but you laugh, but you will scare. Remember kids to move and catch the objects Slappy throws down. Keep an eye on the spookometer. Any items that aren't caught will create noise that fills the spookometer. Causes the headless ghost to waken from his slumber. If the spookometer fills up, the headless ghost will wake up and it's game over. If you see any objects are glowing red, those are trick objects. Make sure to avoid catching them. Oh, jeez. You're fast. Oh my gosh, this is too hard. This game's rigged. Can't beat me, Slappy. I hate the way this looks. This is the pinnacle of modern Goosebumps media. Who's the dummy now, dummy? <laughs> Classic catchphrase. Is this like an endless game? Is this gonna be going on forever? I could do this all day. Ooh. Aha! <laughs> Boom. This is easy. Oh, take that. Get a load of this. Uh-oh. Haunted mask. Something to cover that ugly face of yours. <laughs> Rude. What's going on? Speed up. Wait, no, no, no. Don't speed up. Don't speed up. What's wrong with that hourglass? Is that hour? Why is that hour? Oh, 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 the spookometer! Why it's just spinning in the air? This isn't a hat in time. Whoa! Oh, oh no! Stop it! On. This is not how I expected this to go. It's a real <laughs> oh, oh. Wait, it, it, that, hour, that hourglass hit. Oh, oh, it's coming down. It's so. If if Slappy hits enough with other objects, it might come down eventually one day. Oh oh, what? two times points. The hourglass is getting really close. This game is so bad. You're gonna have some fun now. Garden nuts. My little friends are here to help me. <laughs> oh. Oh, I got the hourglass. It's gone now. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Give me those superpowers. Slow mo. Oh. You're, you're kidding. So, when Slappy throws down an object and I pick up a green object, that object he throws down is just frozen in the air. You're. Oh my gosh. Haha. <laughs> Wake up. I dare you. I am? Maybe we're on Slappy World. Slow mo. We heard all of them are stuck in uh, except for that one. What? Well, wake him up! I don't care. See if I care. 
Yeah, this is just an endless game, isn't it? There's no end to this madness. What happens? Ah! <laughs> What's going on? Oh, whoa, the re controls are reversed. I see. Do it! Just wake up! Why is this meter so long? Uh. Ah! <laughs> it's Slappy World. You're only screaming in it. I don't want to give you a nightmare. <laughs> I want your whole life to be a nightmare. <laughs> No, your score. I could do better than that. I just don't want to sit here all day. Oh my gosh, high score is six thousand eight hundred and seventy. Who is Brain Kangaroo? Thirty. <laughs> Slappy birthday to you. I don't care. Well, I came here to play the 39 plays, but, you know, sometimes things don't always go the way you want them to. And, and you know what? Things went awfully, horribly wrong today, and there's no excuse for that. What's a catapult? Wait, what? What's the catapult? What what did that do? Lucky slide. Free slide. Well, anyway, let's go.